Uh, if we get any kind of uh, message of intelligent life, then I'm going to suggest our scientists uh, try to make contact with it. Astronomers have been looking for extrasolar objects for decades, yet the most amazing things always seem to happen just when all hope seems gone. After decades of nothing, these astronomers found themselves in this scenario. Two objects appeared simultaneously, which was absolutely unexpected. Astronomers and scientists from all around the world, including NASA, took part in the research of these enigmatic guests. What lessons do they teach us? Where did they begin? Where did they come from? The first object to emerge from the void of space was barely visible through the telescope of a Hawaii-based space observatory. When can we predict the arrival of the next one? It was discovered that Vega was the object's place of origin. A 147 trillion light-year distance alien star hurtling through space at a speed of 570 miles per hour. It had a cigar-like shape and was a thousand meters long. For a comet or asteroid, it is not very large. When it was discovered, it had already passed by our sun, made a sharp turn, and was speeding off in a different direction movements and behaviors that are highly unnatural for an asteroid or comet just as astronomers were recovering from the shock and confusion brought on by this unexpected visitor. Harvard scientists are raising the possibility that it's an alien spacecraft. If it was a comet or an asteroid, it may have formed into a disk resembling a spaceship. Another occurrence, another Gennady Borisov appeared. An engineer and amateur astronomer used a telescope from his own observatory in Orkney, Crimea to view a moving object against the early morning sky. He had built himself up. He could immediately see its distinctiveness. It was moving the other way from the comets that reside in the main asteroid belt that orbits the sun. The only remaining question is whether these extraterrestrial visitors are of natural or artificial origin. In order to learn the answer, we must visit their home planet. The first extraterrestrial visitor originated in the Vega star system and was given the Hawaiian name, which means that Scout Vega is known as the past and future North. Star because of the wobbling of the Earth's axis over a period of 26-0 years, the brilliant star Vega which is only 25 light years from Earth, may be seen in the summer sky of the Northern Hemisphere. Our understanding of North gradually changes to include other stars. The North star status of Vega will return in around 12,000 years, as it did many millennia before. Astronomers found an asteroid belt surrounding Vega in the early months of 2013, possibly extraterrestrial planets living among the rock. According to the layout, there are two regions, an inner region with warmer space rocks and an outer region with icy asteroids. One of these rocks was referred to by the name Amuamua, as it was moving at a speed three times faster than Earth's orbit around the Sun. NASA had only 11 days to observe it. When it entered our solar system and passed by Earth abruptly, it was no longer detectable since it was too small and dim to be seen. Then, it abruptly accelerated out of our solar system. We anticipated that Mwamua's orbit would be hyperbolic while it was being tracked, but it wasn't. Instead, it appeared as though there was an additional acceleration, as if something unseen were pushing it. By the time it was discovered, the cigar-shaped object had already zipped by our sun, executed a smooth hip turn, and started, leaving at a rapid pace in another direction. Two issues in particular were of particular concern to scientists. His mysterious acceleration away from the sun was the first. The second was that despite NASA's best efforts to classify it as an asteroid, then a comet, then an asteroid, and finally a comet, in the years that followed, scientific journals and media headlines were rife with wild speculation. Once more, it was very clear that we had no concept of what being honest entailed. Still, we don't. However, Harvard astronomer Avi Loeb posited that it may be a man-made structure made by an advanced extraterrestrial civilization. After reaching its closest point to the sun, 
whatever it was puzzled every one and challenged our understanding of physics. Eventually, someone had the courage to say what every one was thinking, approximately 95,000 kilometers per second, which is extremely fast in relation to our sun and more than enough to ensure the object's escape from our star's gravitational pull is the speed at which it started leaving the solar system, unlike what would be expected from my rough and irregular comet during his Eisus's outgassing. Despite having an enormous velocity, the comet accelerated quite smoothly and steadily. This behavior is normal. Comic in October is extremely unlikely. On July 7, 2017, it was traveling toward the Pegasus constellation with the technology that was available at the time. Amwamu was unable to capture at close proximity for a photograph. As a result, the information available now is all we will ever have. However, there is only one reasonable explanation for all of its curious features. It might be an extraterrestrial spacecraft with a light sail, according to a new study. Indeed, the aliens' many peculiar characteristics that first led to their classification as a comet would be clearly described by an artificial origin. The object was downgraded to asteroids. Observations that failed. The discovery of Amwamua was an anomaly, revealing either a tail or a fuzzy coma. Astronomers have listened for any potential and won more signals using the Green Bank Telescope in West Virginia and the Allen Telescope Array in Northern California. But our solar system does not produce any debris like M1 more. In general, the object has been silent thus far, but 2 Iborosov has shown to be far easier to understand than its cosmic companion. It has been shown that this is the first interstellar comet ever. To I, it is thought that Borisov was made of a combination of water, dust, and carbon monoxide. It had a visible tail and was roughly what scientists had anticipated, similar to those found at the periphery of the solar system. However, I Borisov makes an Amoyer makes it seem even stranger that it is thought to have originated from an ancient solar system revolving around a red dwarf star the dimmest and most common type of star in our galaxy based on its speed and trajectory. One international team has proposed that it could have started close to Ross 573, a white dwarf star located around 629 trillion miles from the sun in a region of space. They believe it was sent into space some 900,000 years ago. One more I'm not claiming that they were aliens, but they were aliens following the violent collision of three large objects in this celestial neighborhood. An advanced alien civilization would create a spacecraft that could hide in plain sight if they wanted to spy on us. But what do I know?